Welcome to Tech Invest. We'll talk about investing, finance, and professional development. As the current time of 4.34 p.m. on Eastern Time, Ethereum country at $1,118, about 1% so far. Respect to over crypto market and the equity market, we had a relatively mixed bag day today. We, uh, on the first half of the day, uh, knowing the fact that today is the first trading day uh, on the equity market uh, after the Juneteenth holiday uh, in the U.S. holiday yesterday. And uh, we had a like across the market, you know, some normalized buying pressure, knowing the fact that last week we were selling off quite severely, that, um, you know, some bulls to be stepping in at a relatively submerged level was a very logical thing to see. But as the, you know, the, the day durates, uh, as we got to that inflection point midway through the trading day, around like noontime, around like 1 p.m., 12 p.m. on the Eastern time, uh, we start to normalize back down a little bit, right? And in respect to Ethereum, uh, we reach all the way up to um, 11, 1190 today. And uh, we could not get to the next level of uh, real resistance, which is, uh, you know, 1250 nor the non subs consolidated level, which is 1200 specifically, right? And right now we basically leap down back to below the prior resistance level, which is 1150. So right now we're about like $25 below it. Um, and at the same time on the MACD front is quite, you know, it looks like we're about to fuse together, but on the RSI it's kind of stale. You can see that clearly we could not break above the 30 mark on the RSI. Uh, so we have to see, can we sustain more bullishness going forward? Uh, and I think we should technically, you know, and organically do so contingent on, you know, just the lack of negative news that we should be expecting going forward. If there's lack of ne negative news coming, uh, we should technically see some sort of a normal buying pressure and reaching back up to more of a normal level, like 1250, 1350 respectively. Right. And then for Bitcoin, you can see that clearly the next level up is going to be somewhere around um, in the in the relatively large one, right, twenty six five hundred. Uh, but obviously you're gonna have some blockade around twenty two five hundred first, all the way up to thirty thousand five hundred, right? And the level down will be eighteen uh, five hundred versus like seventeen five hundred from there, right? And then all the other coins that you see, like respect to classic, is all basically ups and downs on the intervals of fives. Uh, so like 50 cents, like, you know, for example, with respect to classics, like up level will be somewhere around like the, the ways that we're kind of trading on the up uptrend escalator, right? 1650, um, 1750, 18, you know, 20, uh, 2150 respectively. Dogecoin, same thing, right? All the f uh, five intervals in betweens, right? Cardano, the same thing. Solana uh, is a little bit different in comparison. So Solana is going to be trading on... The next level up is going to be somewhere around 38, all the way to 50. Level down will be 25. And just quickly go over XRP, it will be all the flat numbers as well. 35 will be the upward or 40. Uh, downward will be anywhere 30, 25 respectively downward from there. Uh, Polkadot's at 7.78 right now. And I'm just going through this quickly because I feel like I'm repeating myself. So the next level up is going to be $9. Level down will be $6.50, $6.00. Uh, our grants at 30 cents at the moment like levels up will be 35 40 level down will be 30 25 uh, Shiba Inu is up uh, 30% at the moment. So the level up to the next level will be somewhere around like 12 uh, 12 uh, 1200 right you can see that clearly we got canceled out at one point and kind of come back down to 1050 right now uh, which is because like we couldn't get to a next level and the more consolidated level is at the current level. That's why we sold it back down. And I would suggest like, if you bought in when we were at the 700, well, you, you're up quite nicely right now. It probably makes sense to take some profit. Uh, Mac tax up 6% so far, like all the flat numbers, right? Basically 50, 55, uh, 60, 50, 65 from there. And then AVAX, um, 16, basically $17 at the moment, like all the flat numbers, right? 1650, 17, 1750, respectively, upward or downward from here, 1650, $16, 15, uh, respectively. All right, so I'm going through this relatively quickly because I actually have to head, head out and get going. Uh, I have an event to attend to. It's an NFT event uh, based in New York City. For those that don't know, there's an NFT conference going on in New York. And I was invited to this after party, which is, uh, you know, quite nice. Um, so 
plan on spending some time uh, out there, but I do have a meeting in between, so I actually have to hop on a train to and catch the train, so I don't want to miss it because like it comes every 25 minutes. Uh, but yeah, appreciate you ha for joining me again. Apologies for rushing this a little bit, but uh, take care. Bye.